What's up, Wayne Baron here with Dark Fix Studios, and today we're inside of Adobe After Effects 2022. What we're going to be doing is the title sequence we just saw. What that is, is that we've got a vertical text right here, and then we have our horizontal. This is going to show you how to access each one of these within a keyboard shortcut. Let's go ahead and come over here. We're going to create a new composition, and we're going to have this at 19 seconds click on OK. Let's go ahead and hit our text tool. And as you can see, it's already set up for vertical. What we want to do is that we want to hold Control key and hit T, and that would set it up as horizontal. Control T for vertical. So from over here, we're going to do dark. Click here. And that is pretty much all there is to do for that. Let's go ahead and bring all these down to nine seconds right click we're going to pre-compose this this is going to be vertical okay and now we're going to create a new one let's come over here to the edge and then we're going to hold Control t that is going to give us the horizontal so this time we're going to do dark and then we're going to right click on it choose pre-compose and whenever you set your layers like this right here and you can come over here and choose to adjust the composition duration to the time span of the selected layers. And since we have the time span set right here, it will make it so that whenever it creates the new uh, comp, it's going to have it set just like that, just like we did right here with the first one. And see there, that works out great. And that right there is pretty much what you do to create your vertical and your horizontal. And then the only thing that I did was that I just went inside of each one of these and I hit T for opacity and which I don't know where the heck the last one went. So let's come back over here. And the only thing I did was just did opacity. I moved it out to here and then I went to zero. And then the only thing I did was I just changed up each one of them like so. And then I come out to about up to 15 mark. And then I created another keyframe for them. And then right here and went zero. And then I just did pretty much the same thing over again. I moved them like so. Try not to grab a hold of the layer. And then each one of them go off. I really like the vertical look that comes in really handy on a lot of projects. And so to add in that feel right yonder is, is pretty cool. All right, I am Wayne Barron for Dark Effects Studios for vertical and horizontal text within your After Effects projects. Y'all have a good one now. Bye-bye.